All right, we are talking about Notre Dame right tackle Blake Fisher, six foot six, three hundred twelve pounds. This kid doesn't turn twenty one until March this year. He was a four star prospect, number nine offensive tackle in the country. First thing I noticed about him, long arms, wide frame. He has a variety of pass sets that give him really good range in pass protection. Just does a great job climbing up the pocket, using that length to keep the defenders at bay. Really impressed by him there. He has heavy hands that really just stun defenders, stop them in their tracks. And so he flashes some really impressive hand fighting throughout all of his tape. Pass pro is really where this guy shined more. He had power as a run blocker, but was a bit less consistent there. The pass pro was outstanding at times. He really drops his hips really easily, really quickly, in an instant into that anchor. And he's able to keep moving through his anchor. He's not stuck in it. And he generates additional power, pushing defenders out of the way, even though he is fully coiled like that in the anchor. It's impressive how he can keep generating power, keep generating movement despite it. Now, on the negative side, he's a little stiff through his core, through his hips. It leads to contact balance issues for him. Not the easiest mover in space, like not the best puller ever, not the quickest puller ever. He does show explosive athleticism, but the instant short area movement stuff, and especially laterally, isn't great, and he ends up on the ground a lot because of that stiffness. He's over-reliant on his two-hand punch and pass protection, and he has a wind-up with his two-hand throw sometimes that gives defenders a tell and really gives them an easy easy counter to it he it's kind of weird because he does show some ability to vary up his punches but then sometimes he just ends up flat in that two-hand punch all the time kind of along the same lines he struggles to tap into his secondary plan when his initial plan fails he's he, he just kind of ends up stuck in the mud a little bit he's slow with his hands slow with his feet you can almost see him thinking out there Again, this kid is 20 years old. They're still learning to do. I'm really interested in this guy. I think he might be able to be a really strong guard prospect with potential to keep playing offensive tackle. I think he has a lot of traits to like.